If you're not happy with your life, you have nobody to blame but yourself. My name is Sterling Cooper. I'm an award-winning adult film star, former high-class male companion, and I'm here to help you improve your sex life. Fuck being average. Seriously. Like, screw all of this victim mentality mindset bullshit that gets preached so much in the mainstream media and the mainstream narrative we have these days. If you are not happy with some aspect of your life, hell, you might not be happy with any aspects of your life, you need to do something about it. Look, some people are completely content with their life. Some people are completely content with living an average life, with living a mediocre life, with living what I call like the cookie cutter life. You know, like the wife and two kids, like 50K a year job, living suburb suburban lifestyle, weekends with, you know, the other couples who have kids and that kind of stuff. Like it's the very, very cookie cutter that you would see in like a Hallmark movie or a Disney movie or something. You, it's just the, the American dream kind of lifestyle. If that is appealing to you, if that's happy to you, fine. No judgment on my half. You go right ahead and live that life. But there's a hell of a lot of guys out there who are not happy with that kind of lifestyle. They want something beyond the mediocre. They want something beyond the norm, beyond average. They want something extraordinary. They want a life that is different. And that is totally okay to want that. But to get that, you have to be a savage. You have to be obsessed. Now, you don't have to look down on people who have normal average lives, not at all. But you have to realize that you need to do different things to the average person in order to have a different life. And you need to be obsessed with changing your life. So if you want to live an above average sex life, if you want to have a crazy sex life, have, have threesomes, foursomes, gangbangs, harems, right? You need to do things differently to other people because the actions that other people are taking are gonna get you the same results that other people are getting, okay? And you need to fundamentally believe that it is possible as well. Like, a large part of my success, a large part of the reason why I was able to go from a friggin' 3,000 person farming town in the middle of buttfuck nowhere, rural Western Australia, to shooting in, with the biggest porn companies in the world in Los Angeles is because I believed I could do it. And I was stubborn about it. I refused to accept that I couldn't do it. That kind of pig-headedness, and I'll go on a little tangent here, society will kind of, especially with men, society will tell men that it's bad for them to be stubborn, for them to be pig-headed, for them to be unwavering, and for them to be obsessed with something. I'm here to tell you that's complete bullshit. It is a good thing if you are obsessed. It's a good thing if you are stubborn, because you either have to, you have to be too stubborn to quit. You have to be too stubborn to give up. You have to be too stubborn to accept the normal, average, mediocre life that everyone else lives in order for you to have an exceptional life. So what aspects of your life are you the most frustrated with right now? We live in the internet age. We live in an age where you can get access to basically any information you have ever wanted at the touch of your fingertips. And so because of that, there's no excuse for you to not get everything you want out of life. The only thing that's stopping that is you. Your focus, your time, where you're, where you're dedicating your time and your energy, where you're dedicating your focus to, and then going after it unapologetically, stubbornly, and believing that you can actually do it in the first place. Now, if you want to learn some more harsh truths about reality, about female nature in particular, then I suggest you watch my most honest interview ever.